Hey y'all, welcome back to my channel. Today I'm gonna to make the kids some salmon with broccoli and cheese. I have my cast iron skillet um, warming up right now with a little olive oil in the bottom of the pan. I'm gonna get that nice and hot. We're gonna season the salmon with Obey, onion powder, garlic powder, black pepper, and sea salt. two at a time. For the broccoli, I have a little bit of water at the bottom of the pan, salt and pepper. And I'm gonna put a lid on it. And I'm not gonna let it get too soft. Do the extra. Why you just can't turn over? Okay, the broccoli is right where I want it. I drained the water at the bottom because I didn't want them all like soggy. Um, I drained the water at the bottom. I'm gonna add some butter. Let the butter melt, and I cut the aisles. I don't want them too, 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 too soft. I cut the aisles, I'm gonna let this butter melt. You can stick a fork through them, so that's good for me. The rest of the way is gonna cook from the rest of the heat off the eye. I'm also gonna season the broccoli with just a little bit more seasoning, so just like a little, um, just for like a little, little razzle dazzle. Other one out already. This was the side that the skin is on. I took the skin off. And then I'm going to put the other two in and let those cook. And then I'll take the skin off those as well. Because it really just slide off once you flip it over and let it sear a little bit. It really just slide off. And I'm cool with that. See, with the heat off, it's still cooking. Still a little crunchy, but they're not too, too soft. And I don't like them too, too soft. The kids don't like it too, too soft either. They won't eat it. I'm going to put some cheese on top. The last two salmon's cooking. I'm going to add some cheddar cheese on top. And then from the heat, the steam that it's coming from, that, that's how that cheese is going to melt. I'm going to put the top back on there. We don't like no mushy broccoli, baby. And this was frozen broccoli that I used. You can use the kind that's not frozen, but I use frozen broccoli. Put the heat on there, and then it's gonna melt. It's gonna do its thing. It's already melting. Beautiful. 